Mariano Flordeliz and Nubla in Tantay ang ating mga opisyales. They're gonna call all those fouls and try to uh, keep everybody in check. At agad-agad sa unang sequence pa lang. So as to uh, make uh, a lot of complicated actions para rito kay Jun Mar Fajardo. They let Eram take it from three. And you see Eram made them pay. Eram will try again. And he'll hit again. That's back to back. From outside, mula kay J.P. Eram. Well, you take a look at Poy Eram. He has that time, he has the space, and more importantly, he has the confidence not just to launch it, but also to knock it in against the defense of Jun Mar Fajardo. Ito yung Mikey Williams-Ross matchup. A third three-pointer para rito kay Poy Eram. Si Alan Kaidik ba yan? <laughs> San Miguel looking to put a bucket in. Hesitation, bumitao pasok para kay Terrence Romeo. May kasama ng hesitation yun, Coach Ray. And that turned out to be a good timeout for Coach Ray Austria. Good defenders in the league who can really get their goat. Lalo pag veterano kalaban niya. Oh, Chris Ross jacks it up from outside. Well, what you're seeing is this game is actually being played on Spurs. After the timeout of Coach Ray Austria, eight straight points naman ang ginanti ng San Miguel. Montalvo naman, umatake. He's really improved his offense. You know, everybody talks about him or talked about him in rookie last season. Pass inside to Arwin. The jumper fading away. Basket good para kay Arwin. Nahihirapan talaga si Jason Castro because he's being guarded by Chris Ross. So now, Jason Castro is being guarded by Terrence Romeo. But in the first play, when Jason Castro came in, hindi pa siya kinailangan ng opensa. Looking for your offense. Si Pogoy talaga inatras pa eh hanggang sa three-point line para... Shoot. Here's Mikey Williams waltzing in. Para sa layup on the other side. Balik sa double digits ang lamang ng TND. 20 to 10. They've doubled up. Masyado na matagal eh. Masyado na diba? matagal. Oh, taken away. Nahabasa ni Poy Eram yung pasa na yun. Here come the white shirt. Castro to Pugoy. Goes under the defense of Chris Ross. Another bucket para kay Arian. 22 to 10. It's a 12-point lead. The biggest of the game. Checks out his defender. Brian Arruela is there. Ini atras takes the shot from three, knocks it down. CJ, what do we say? Sabi na kakasabi din natin eh. Eruela to the hoop, fakes, tabag noto, drops it to Troy Rosario and Brian Eruela creating in the paint. You know he's gonna be there. You'll have the confidence to drive the lane and drop it to him. Tabag to Junmar. Not a bad option either on the other side. But what is important is because of his heads up play, again on both ends of the floor, he has earned minutes here for TNT. They've been leading from the start. It was 11-0 at one point. Ryan Reyes, too strong. Kobuntin follows it up and gets it to go. So again, a massive start. A good start for TNT here while limiting San Miguel to just 20 points. Shooting percentage is of 50% for TNT and just 6 of 19 for San Miguel Beer in that first quarter, Coach RG. And Pogoy continues yung kanyang accuracy dito sa second period. Trying to go around the defense of Castro. Wanted to leave it for Junmar na anticipating Kobunti. Napa head to the white shirt. Ang daming numero dyan. Castro for the layup. All the break. Pinag-aralan na yan ng TNT. We'll see if they made the necessary adjustments. Now, Terrence Romeo nakawala doon. Gets that to roll in. He only played six games in the elimination round for San Miguel because he had a lot of injuries. But still, he averaged 19 points per game. TNT guys hoping he can explode finally here in the semis. Pogoy, put the sacanto. Montalvo, bumidal mula sa tres. And Kim Montalvo knocks it down from the corner. Here's Kim Montalvo. They leave him open from three. Dalawa na yan para kay Montalvo here. In the second period, Dave Marcelo finally taps it to a teammate. Forward pass to Pogoy. Pogoy last hit her one on one, crossing him over. Oh, look at that basket! Pulaki RR Pogoy! Look at that, a little crossover and then eluding the defense of Chris Ross for an end one play for him. Because he coach Leo Austria, coach right. You don't want your team to do that every time. And especially, you know that you're struggling big time. Chris Ross, Tautua, Titira ng Tres. Di pumasok, Jun Mar! Nagmamalo sa loob. Tinabilan ng mga nakaputi. That was quick. It's down to 13. Williams on the move. Off the glass. Gets it to go. Chance for the three-point play. And he finally decided na hindi na siya titira mula sa beyond the arc. Troy Rosario trying to resist him. Cross court to Cabagnot. Andun si Castro. Cabagnot, the bump, the space, the basket. Now Williams. 
Goes back to Troy, hits one from just about there to tie it up. Last ball game in the uh, final minute. They're close to 40% from deep in today's ball game. Tautua gets it. Ganda nung set up sa kanya ron. Upstairs to Eruela. Again, finally someone's open, but Pogoy can't put it in. Troy Rosario goes up just in time. The big man of PNP just being at the right place and at the right time, it hit a little bit yung rim. Kaya hindi natawagan. Ah, exacto rin sa pagbitaw ni Troy Rosario. And the half ends. It's a 12-point difference. 54 to 42. Pabor sa TNT. Outside to Pogoy. Kick to the corner. William sets. Had all day. Para sa three-pointer na yun. That's his first three-pointer sa larong ito. Fourth turnover again by San Miguel. Yeah, Meron biglang babantayan nila sa tres. They're not gonna leave him open anymore in this game. Oh, <laughs> off the glass. R.R. Pogoy. From the top of the key, looked for that window. Masado mataas para kay Arwin Santos who lost it out of bounds. So the defense is working for TNT. And so is the offense, Coach Ryan. In the first quarter, so he likes the defense. And he is just, again, making sure that John Marco Hardo will respect his outside shot. Plus 21 in player efficiency, while Terrence Romeo is minus 26. So lucky right. the slight bump towards the end. Panorin natin. Ito paglabas niya, oh. Halos uh, yung kanyang chant lang ang tumama eh, di ba? Kay uh, CJ, but far from over with still 8:23 here and a full 12 in the fourth quarter and CJ Perez slowly humming already here in the second half. Another basket para sa kanya. Down to 16 and lamang ng TNT. It was 21. Just a couple of minutes uh, gone by. Mikey Williams open from 3. He gets his second three-pointer to go. Mikey Williams against Chris Roth. That's been a familiar matchup. Mikey in the paint. Kinaliwa. He loves to do that, actually, to go to his offhand. That uh, is actually part of his calling card. When he came off college, you know that he's a defensive specimen. Na improve niya lang talaga yung offense niya dito sa PBA. That's a miss from outside. Terrence Romeo the board. Pass way ahead to Mo. Ganda nung pasa na. Kompleto naman ni Mo Tautua. Keep the score. Close because they know that if it is close entering the fourth, my chance of Pasila. Teto Romeo Montalbo. And he got Montalbo up in the air. Hey, there they go. Yun nga si nasabi natin kanina pa yan eh. Montalbo not backing down at all against the veteran. And Terrence Romeo, really, that's, that's, that started in the elimination. You know, he, I'm sure he remembers that he got the goat of Romeo back then, and Montalbo's doing it again in this game. But if you're TNT, you really don't want to get Terrence Romeo going. He has a total of 16 points already. They took it away. Red shirts on the attack. CJ Perez. Perez right now spins. And don't see Dave. Guapo, pero Simon Tautua puts it back in. Ryan in the lane. Balik kay Jason. Jason to the hoop. Gets the contact. Basket goes. Romeo. Takes the jumper from 15. Pasok na naman yan para kay Terrence. First line defender or a rim protector. He will always make himself available. CJ on the attack. Puts it up and in. Marshall always a threat. That is exactly what happened in game two. Oh, oh. You look at the flow of this ball game. San Miguel turned the ball over 22 times already. Almost another turnover. While TNT has only thrown the ball over seven times. With eight seconds, he kicks to Pogoy. Baseline drive. And Sikip, turn around, jumper. Ayaw, Eram, offensive rebound. Wow. Oh! Off the glass. That lead is 17. Could have been just 15, but it's 17 as we enter the fourth. Montalbo will go baseline. Finds Pogoy sa kabilang panic. Bilif ng release. Oh, look at that confidence coach. Right. Didn't even think about it. Pagtama sa kamay niya. Pinato agad. Eram. Pogoy, the hot hand. Whoa, Eram there to clean it up para kay R.R. Pogoy. And what a game, huh? Efficient game for Poy Eram. Yes. And look at the way Kim Bontalbo reads the situation, Coach Ryan. Ibig sabihin, may oras pa. Junmar outside to Arwin. Good start right there. Ayun na ngayon. And that three can really bring you back big time. And quickly. Williams wants them back. He got hit! It's a possible four-point play by Mikey Williams. 
but this is going to be a four-point play opportunity. So what he wants is to impress his coach that he has the energy. Seven remaining, or seven and forty remaining here in the ball game. Eh, bukod pa dyan, uh, Coach Ryan. Kailangan mo ng stops. Nineteen points already oh. for Mikey Williams. That's gonna be an easy layup for Kabagdot. Nakalusot dun sa depensa ng TNT. Yung kumpiyansya niya, umangat na. Saan naman yung scoring para sa San Miguel. Romeo with twenty, Perez fourteen. Tautu was in double digits as well, so is this guy. And TNT's uh, players, you know, kahit sinong ipasok ni Coach Sean Reyes. Para rito sa TNT, points from turnovers, 29 to 10. Again, Tropang Giga, lording it over. And not only that, second chance points are the very reasons why TNT is comfortably on top in this ball game. Heram, got his own miss. Kala niya, nakuha niya niya yung reverse. Bumiti ng konti, but he was there. He's got a double-double sa game na ito. It's ganda talaga ng performance niya. And lead pass. Pogoy looked like he wanted to go for the jump. Well, look at the defense for an TNT. Gamalinda finally gets one to go. It was a very close encounter. But TNT just getting ready with guns of blaze. Gryan missed. But now he'll take it to the basket using his off hand. Because Kaliweta is well, a teaching moment. Eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yun yun yung ano dun, yung yeah. excuse. Ba? That's why that, that, that was my preamble. Eh. That is our final score. 115 to 98 in favor of TNT. They go up 2 1.